G'day guys, in this video we're going to introduce a brand new concept which is the velocity of money and then we'll use that to explain what's called the quantity theory of money. So velocity is a measure of how fast money is circulating through the economy and we measure it as velocity equals nominal GDP divided by the money supply or equivalently we can say that V for velocity equals the price level times real GDP, which will give you nominal GDP, divided by M for money supply. Now I think to understand what velocity of money is, it's best to go straight into an example. So let's say that the nominal GDP is $900 billion and the money supply is measured as $300 billion. What is the velocity of money? From the equation we just introduced, velocity is equal to nominal GDP of 900 billion divided by the money supply of 300 billion. And this will give us 3. So what does this value of 3 actually mean? Well, recall that in an economy we've got two major sectors. We've got our firms and our households, and we know we've got more than that, but let's just focus on these ones. And there is money flowing from firms to households and from households back to firms. Within the economy, we are given that the money supply is $300 billion. So 